Hi everyone, it's Mrs. Patriarcha, and I'm excited to be doing your reading lesson with you today. Today, I wanna to teach you three tips for setting your reading life up at home. My first tip that I wanna give you today is to think about finding a good spot to read. So now that we're going to be doing much of our learning at home, we wanna think about um, where is a space that we can really concentrate? Right, that's free of distractions. So when I was finding some spots in my house, I had to think about where are the other people in my house? Are they going to be coming through? Are they going to be talking? And is that going to distract me? I had to think about where the TV was and if that was going to be on. I also had to think about where I was putting my own phone and my own device so that I wasn't distracted. Some things that we wanna think about when we're finding that great spot to read is we wanna think about the lighting. If the lighting is too dark, it's gonna be tricky to read, right? And sometimes if it's too bright, it can be a little challenging too. So you wanna find a lighting that's just right for you. You also wanna think about the noise in that space and make sure that it's not too noisy for you to be able to concentrate. And you also wanna think about what the seating is like. Is it a place where you're comfortable, but maybe not so comfortable that you you know, maybe you would rather take a little nap, um, but also a place where you know that you can be really doing some good thinking work along with your reading. So that's the first thing. We want to find that great spot in our house. And sometimes you might have one really great spot and other times you might find that you have like a few spots that you might try and might go to. My second tip for building our reading life at home is to find time to read and to make it a habit. So I've been trying this too. I have found that it works really well for me to do a little bit of reading right after I have breakfast. So I have my breakfast and then afterwards I set a little bit of time aside that I can do some reading. I've also found that it's really nice to be able to do a little bit of reading before bed. So you'll wanna think about your day and what you have going on and you're gonna to wanna to find some times in your day that reading works really well for you. And sometimes you might find that, oh, that didn't work well, and you wanna keep trying, but you wanna find some times that reading works well for you, and then you wanna stick to those times and make it a habit. My last tip for today is that we want to find and collect things that we're excited to read. So I know that you have taken books home from school and some of you may have your own books at home. Um, I have a whole collection of books right now that I'm excited to dive into. Um, this is a really great time if you have a chance to get into series books because you have a little more time on your hands at home and series books are awesome because you can go from one book to the next to the next or you might find that you have an author that you love and you may wanna just try to read as many books by that author as you can. But others of you may just find this is a great time to just read any book and really develop your own idea of what you really are interested in, what you love. I've been doing a lot of reading of online articles too. So some online article reading and then also um, some books that I've been getting into that I've really been enjoying. So those are my three tips for today to really get our reading lives going at home. We wanna make sure that we find a great spot. So I hope all of you do that if you haven't already. I want you really to be thinking about what times in your day work well for reading and then also finding and collecting things that you're excited to read. I can't wait to hear about the spots that you found and the times of the day work well for you. And I'm super excited to hear about the things that you're reading. Until next time, happy reading. Talk soon.